Hey, this is Mikey with another After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, I want to talk about a plugin that you may not have ever used or maybe you've seen and really haven't experimented with and maybe it will show a couple of fun things you can do with that. And that is CC Split number two. Mikey's Production Tips is brought to you by Cinema Spice. After Effects tools, video overlays and backgrounds, and sound effects. Now I'm doing CC Split 2, not just CC Split because they're practically the same, but 2 is just a little bit better. So um, in order to find this, let's click on a layer on the background. Let me let me hide um, these top two layers. Um, highlight my background, Effect, Distort, CC Split 2. Now I guess we could talk about the difference. Uh, CC Split, I, what it does is it splits open and makes almost like a mouth, right? Um, and then you can adjust where these points are to where you want the, the hole in your layer to be. That's CC Split 1. Um, CC Split 2, the difference is um, right off the bat you have Split 1, Split 2 where you can go one side or the other and that's pretty cool so this is kinda looks like a mouth but there's some fun things because right here look at this it says profile and when I click on that you can see that looks like that looks like this see how that looks like that so what I can do is there's some different profiles, presets, already built in, or I can make my own. And it can do some really cool things. First off, what I want to show is if we just do straight, fill the whole thing up, then what we got is it moving straight up and down. And what I want to use this for is you've probably used this effect before where um, you have a background and they kind of slam together like it's a door opening or closing. So if I take these point A and point B and move them, I'm going to hold down shift so they stay in the same horizontal or vertical plane. And let's just move these out past the edge of the, the piece of footage. And now... I can move these up and down. Now you've probably done that before where you take the background, you duplicate it, you mask it, you move them independently. Um, but with this CC split too, it's pretty simple. And if I want these to move at the same time, I can just connect split one and split two together with an expression. Right here, there's a pick whip from split two. I can just connect that one to split one and then they will both move at the same time. You know, so maybe it's a, you know, this slams down and the logo comes on top of it. I'm sure you've seen something like that before, but you, look how easy that was to do. Now the next thing I want to show you with uh, Profile is to get a little bit, or with CC Split 2, is to get a little bit weird with the profile. And um, so here's a, a picture of a lady, and let's add Split to it. But let's take this Profile um, let's make it completely down at the bottom, and then let's just, I'm going to click in a few spots. And let's take this profile, um, the point A and point B, and let's move them to the back of where this footage is. And you can see as I split that, it almost looks like a like a pixel sorter type thing, which is really cool. And how um, split works is the further away these points are, it'll scale what this profile looks like, right? So this is basically point A, point B in this profile from one side to the other. So what I can do is if I move these up and down, it'll scale the whole thing. or bring them closer and it makes everything a lot smaller 
You can see that right there. So that is CC Split. And I've been able to use this for quite a few things and it's it's really kind of a cool plugin. Now the thing that's interesting about it, let's go back to this one, is the way it moves is not linear. So that could be problematic or it could not be. It just depends on what you're trying to achieve with it. But I thought you'd need to know as you're experimenting with this. So let's bring um, these in closer so we can see. And as it goes up, you can see it kind of compresses everything instead of just moving it. Almost like some sort of uh, ease to the compression. You can see these, since the, you can, this is very straight lines, you can see these ones right here are compressed more than this up here. So it's a very kind of a fluid, natural movement, which is kind of cool. So that is CC Split 2. Uh, check it out. Try it out. Make yourself an effect where, you know, you have the top and the bottom slamming down like this. And you can also move these points around. They don't have to be straight. And there you go. CC Split 2. Try something out. I'd love to see what uh, you come up with, especially if you're doing something creative with the profile, something crazy like this. Um, if you have any examples, please uh, just post them down in the comments below. And uh, thank you so much, and we'll see you next time.